Hello, my sweet babies. How's everyone doing today? I guess I'm doing all right. Hope everybody had a blessed Christmas. I got some blessings, babies. Yes, I did. I want to show y'all what I got. Now, I've tore everybody's address off because I don't want to flash it to the world. So... All right, let's get started, baby dolls. I move my little pan because I don't want this. Is what Miss Stacy made me ain't that pretty? Ain't that just so pretty? It's sparkly. Look at it. It's just gorgeous. I love it, and it writes good too, Miss Stacy. Sure does, baby. Let me get some lights on the subject. There we go. All right, now let's start with this. This is from Miss Tanya McCord. It's a Christmas card, my baby. Wishing you love and happiness to fill your heart this Christmas. I hope you have a very merry and blessed Christmas this year and a happy new year. Love, Tanya. Oh, seek him. I love these. Look at that. And look, this says seek him. That's beautiful. I love that. Thank you, Miss Tanya. Thank you, baby doll. It's really pretty. Put it right there. And next we have Miss Margaret Woods. Miss Margaret. And sending warm wishes. Oh. Wanda, have a wonderful holiday season with your family from my house to yours. I wish you peace and joy filled with wonderful blessings. I have included an ornament I made for you along with this card. Hope you like it. Much love, Miss Margaret Woods. She made this card. With their own little sweet hands. Miss Margaret, you crafty dafty. Look at you. Ain't that pretty? That is pretty. I love that. Look at here. It's got my name on it. And it's got a cross. Is that not gorgeous? Oh, it's pretty. I'm going to hang it up here on my tree. I'm telling you right now where it's going. Thank you, Miss Margaret, for that beautiful card. Thank you, darling. Now, Miss Margaret also said these. Now, let me go and tell you about this. Because I ate them up. I ate them. I saw these and thought I'd send a few. I love olives, and you said you did, too. Enjoy. These olives was lemon and rosemary. I did not even know that olives came in flavors. And this one was basil and garlic. Huh. Honey, I woke these down like a Sibylla cow. I'm telling you what I did. I did. I made this for you since you said you love pearls. I hope it fits. Oh. Oh, Miss Margaret. Let's see what we got in here. See what we got in here. Look at that, guys. It's got Jesus on the cross. Oh, that's beautiful. Yes, ma'am, it'll fit. I got a little wrist, but big boondock hands. Oh, my God, that's gorgeous. That is gorgeous. It says, made with love. Is that not beautiful? Oh, wow, wow. Miss Margaret, that's gorgeous. I love that. Thank you so much. Let me get it back in this bag because I don't want no resin getting on it because we finna do my next to the oldest granddaughter, Lily. She informed me she needs an eyelash tray because she's done started wearing fake eyelashes, y'all. Let me put my beautiful little ornament on this tree. And so, that's what we're going to be doing today. Making her a eyelash tray and I want to make some tri trivets I want to make some more trivets too and mama needs some I think now then this right here is from Miss Stacy and Miss Stacy said this is a much better pen for diamond painting than the little pink ones Merry Christmas my sister from Stacy Snow oh thank you Miss Stacy thank you Margaret 
Thank you, Miss Tanya. Look here. Look here, guys. Oh, that pen's so pretty. And look, you get extras. You get extras. This is the wax things and their hearts. Ain't that beautiful? And then you get extra tips. I'm talking about all different sizes in there. And then you get the beautiful pen. And it comes with tips. And it's a double-ended. Double-end. Double-ended pen. Y'all know what that means, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> I do. I know what it means. I have got to uh, do that diamond paint. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I'm nervous about it. Now, this is the directions that come with it. Tell you how to change your tips out and stuff. Okay. Thank you, Miss Stacy. I appreciate y'all so much. Thank you so very much. I love it all. I love it. I appreciate it too. Now, Les Resin sent me these. And they are holographic molds. Now, uh oh, Miss Rose. Look out, Miss Rose. I'm going to open it. Oh, I was going to do these today, but oh. I think I'll do on New Year's Day. Now, I don't know if you're going to be able to see, but they're holographic. Let me see. I don't have, yeah, there you go a little bit. I can't, uh, I don't have anything black to put back there. But two of them are like squares. And two of them have like triangles and, and um, all that stuff on it. So we're going to be doing them. And I like the way they're made. I like the rim that it's going to have. I love a coaster with a rim. See? It's got like triangles and stuff. And I've got some um, stickers that Miss Frances bought me when she came down here to visit me. Uh, it's like um, out of space stuff. And I think I'm going to be putting them in there. Because that one with the squares and stuff on it reminds me of, you know, the stars and moon and all that stuff. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to be doing that. Thank you, Les Resin, Miss Bessie. Thank you so much. Then, look at this. They sent me tabletop coating epoxy. One to one volume, bubble free, crystal clear, self leveling formula, mold friendly. Look at this. Look at this monster. Let's see what's off in here. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, yeah. I love these cups. So, you get gloves. You get two mixing cups. If I can get them apart. Oh, my God. Come on, baby. There you go. You get two mixing cups. Look how clear. I love these cups. You know what? I might use one. And then you get the foam brushes because this is tabletop. But we're not going to be using it as tabletop. We're going to see if it will work as putting it in. Maybe uh, I'm going to use something small. Like maybe we'll make some necklaces or something. Then you get your resin. Tabletop resin. And of course... Of course. Oh, you get a spreader. And you get directions on how to use it. What the working time is. Then you get this. It's got all, everything. Less resin sales just about in it. I love these little pamphlets. And then this right here is about your resin. Uh-huh. Sure is. Casting epoxy. Coating, coating epoxy. This is tabletop. So, let me see. Uh, I'm trying to see what the working time is. Oh, here we go. Coating epoxy resin will have a working application time of no more than 25 minutes once mixed. Woo! Holy mess! Holy mess, honey. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. And you get some stir sticks. So we're going to leave those out too because we're going to be using that. Alright. And then this is your... This is not your... This is B. This is... The tabletop resin. Look at that. Get part A and part B. Ain't they the sweetest babies ever? Have y'all not noticed every time I get low of my super clear 
or almost out, I receive resin. Is that not a blessing? That's a blessing, ain't it, babies? It sure is. I'm thinking God saying, oh, no, no, baby doll. You ain't finna run out of resin. You finna get my word out there. Amen. All right, sweet lips. Let's see. I'm gonna mix up my resin. Now, like I said, we're gonna be doing this uh, eyelash. It holds six pair. I made my oldest grandbaby one when she started wearing eyelashes. So, now my next one wants one. So, I'm just gonna make it like a I don't know. I ain't got my colors or nothing out, but I wanted to show y'all what I got. Now, let's put these babies in the monkey coconut, because every one of them's done one, I think. I know Miss Margaret has, and I know Miss uh, Miss Stacy, and I think Miss Miss Tanya, too. Yeah, I think she did. I think she did. I think everybody's done one, almost. And I think I'm going to try to have a Wednesday giveaway tomorrow. Yes, baby dolls. That's what I'm going to try to do. All right, darling angels. Y'all are going in the Rosie the Sugar Star, baby. Miss Margaret going off in the Sugar Star. Miss Tanya. There you go, little machine. Off in the Sugar Star. And Miss Stacy. There you are. All right, darling angels. Thank y'all so much, babies. Y'all the sweetest ever. Sweetest ever, darlings. Now, let me put Miss Margaret up here on the blessing board. Let me put her And is Miss Tanya? No. Miss Stacy's already up there. Miss Stacy stays up there. Yes, she does, my sister. A sweet angel. All right. Now then, I'm going to, I think I'm, I'm not, I don't want to dust it. I don't. Because I want it to kind of be see-through. And then, this is the lid. And I'm going to see if I can, um, I got some little things that you screw in and it'll just flip. And then I got a thing that will lock it so it won't open. So I'm going to try to do that too. All right, baby. So I'm gonna use these gloves too. Hey, all right. So let me get my colors, and I may put some flowers in here. I think that'd be pretty. Put some flowers in there. Something needs to go in there for sure. But I'll be right back. Let me get my resin mixed up, darlings. All right, babies. So I hadn't mixed up my resin yet, but her favorite color is red. So I found these, oh, are those not gorgeous? Those red flowers. And then, of course, I got some leaves and greenery and stuff. But I want to um, put these beads around the edge. There's red in there and gold and white. Now, her favorite color is red, but we're going to just go for it, okay? And if she don't like it, I'll make her another one. See, mostly all red. I'm going to get this big, big mama here out. Oh, my God. This might not be good. <laughs> it might not be. Oh, Lordy. It might not work out like I'm thinking. It might be harder. I'm going to have to take these gloves off. I've got half of my resin mixed up. I'm just letting it sit there and the bubbles come up because it's still kind of chilly off up in here. So, anyway. And then I'll mix the other part with it when I get through with this here. And that way it won't go hard on me. Whew. How many is glad Christmas is over? I didn't get to go to Mama's, but I did go to Daddy's grave. I did. Made it. Made it there. But uh, it was just, it was freezing. And I could not put Girlie outside in it. I just, I can't. I can't. 
There's no way I would have enjoyed myself knowing she was outside. In her house, true enough, but freezing cold out there. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I, I can't do it. I have neighbors that leave their animals outside in, in their little coops, their little houses, but I can't. It's just too cold. I don't, I, I don't know how they even function, knowing that they're out there. I just don't know. But they do, I guess. So, I'm going to get this around this rim here. Y'all know what? I'm getting mostly red. I guess because this spoon is so little, I don't know. But I like that white. That white's pretty. I was in a blah mood yesterday. Ugh. Oh, man, I was just blah. I said, get your ever-loved butt in that art room and get off this couch right this minute. So, here I am. <laughs> Not all of me's here, but I, I'm here. That's what counts, ain't babies. That is what it counts. That's what counts. I'll see that one's big. I'm going to show y'all. I got these from the Dollar Tree. I thought they was cute. Oh, it's a mix. Let me see. This is what it says. Aqua glass pebbles. Uh-huh. Got two packages of them. Because y'all know I'm a tour. Well, I have to do two. Alright, now then. Got that. Got that off in there. I'm going to think I'm going to go around the edge of this tray, but see, the tray has a lip, so, but, I'm going to do it, oh, I'm going to do it, Let's see what it looks like, and just pray that I don't get, I don't want these big ones, pray I don't get mini bubbles under there, hope I don't, anyway, I'm going to pick them up, and then, uh, put them in, spread them out when I get through. They don't have to go under the rim. You know, just toot on that spoon. Toot on that spoon. Toot on it. I'm going to just sprinkle it in. There we go. That's easier. These are pretty little, little, what are they? Pretty little pebbles, they call it. Say, I don't know. I'm going to pick these big ones out. Well, I got my diamond painting out. Oh, 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 oh Lord, it be. I'm nervous. <laughs> but Miss Stacy done sent me a good diamond painting pen. So, honey babies, got to get it done. And I'm excited about it. It's a cross. And I know it's going to be beautiful. I just know it. It's going to be gorgeous. I do have my heat mat on. Mm -hmm. It's on. Like right now. Because I want my mold heated up. Before my resin hits it. Because if my mold is heated. And when the resin hits it. It will pop the bubbles. See what I'm saying? There's all kind of fluff on the file in there. All kind of fluff. Look at that big mama. Ooh. That's a big one. Hope she likes it. I just thought different colors around the edge. You know, I don't want all solid red. You know what I'm saying? That'd be too much red, I think. But, like I say, if she don't like it, I'll just make her another one. But I think she's going to like it. I love these little pebbles. I got my laser heater on. I hope it's not... Look at that. Did not one little one come out of there. What in the mess? Here's my little cup. Yep. I'm going to put these in here. 
Hmm. Oh. I'll put these in here. How about that? Now I won't get them again. Good lord. This might be a long video, babies. Mm -hmm. It might be. You just don't want them sticking up above your mold. That's all. You want them little enough so they'll, um, they won't be sticking out. So, that's what I'm going for. A little bit of red in there. Come on out there, Mama Jama. And, okay. Oh, no, no. Get out. I think the whole lid would be pretty in these things, don't y'all? <laughs> I think they would. Uh-huh, I think that'd be pretty. Wow, I don't know why my little beads ain't coming out. There we go now. There we go. Now I just got to make sure none are sticking up above my rim. Push them in. Okay. I think Christ Fire sending me some more um, things to do, so yay. Christ Fire has some good molds, y'all. Those molds are good. For, for real. They're sturdy. Sure. So I think I got some something coming from them. I don't know if it's molds. I can't remember even what I chose. But, anyway. Alright. Okay. There we go. Now, if y'all have a YouTube channel, y'all can go to bbcraft.com and they will send you free molds to review on your channel. Uh huh. Yes, they will. I'll put it in the description, babies. bbcraft.com. I'm gonna need a little bit more red right here. I think. Okay. There we are. I think I want the corners a little thicker. You know. If I can find some little ones. I want the corners to be out a little more. So, give me one more minute. There we go. Oh, crap. I wound my um, grandfather clock up. Because I hadn't wound it in I don't know how long it's been. Oh, God. I don't know how many years. And I'm like, oh, I want to hear it. Because I love it when it goes off. And the doggone thing won't even dangling anymore. I'm going to have to look at it and see why it's not dangling. Okay, this one needs to come out. I like love machines. I think that's going to be it. Now, I'm going to mix up more resin. I need a little bit more red in this corner here. So I'm just going to pop these off. Right there, and put them in here. Like that. And I think this, the rest of it's good. Okay. Alright. Now, let me mix my resin. And um, I'll be back. Alright, babies. I got my resin mixed up. Hope I didn't mix up too much. I mixed up a cup and I'm using the rest of my little super clear. I still got, I might have two cups left. So, yay! So, I'm going to start using this stuff less resin seat, man. I can save 
my super clear for something else. All right. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour the clear in the middle and just let it spread out. Okay. Then I'm going to lay my flowers down. Now it's just going to be a thin layer. Thin layer. So I'm going to start on this one. And let it just push on to the ends. Because if you pour it in the middle, it'll push out. If you pour it around the edge, it might move your gems, you see. So we don't want that. So that's what I'm going to do. Just let it move on out. I'm going to help it. Help it out. And I did spray the mold with alcohol before I poured this resin in to help pop them bubbles that I know is going to be on the edge. Just clinging to this edge and loving it. Mm hmm They love edges. Okay. Now then. That should be good. <coughs> Make sure all this is covered. Nope. So I'm going to put a little bit more in here and push it to get those edges. There we go. Because you want your, um, whatever you have going around the edge, you want it covered. So just pick up some and put it on top of it. Okay. There we go. Try not to move them. Oh. Okay, I think that's it. It's kind of hard to tell with this clear resin. But I don't think that's it. Alright. Alright. Now we can lay our flowers down. I did mix up too much. But I'm going to... Let me blow it first. Any bubbles acting like they want to stay in there. Maybe it'll pop. And I must have done move my table because it looks like it's all going to that end. Mm -hmm. I probably did it when I was cleaning. Like it. Pieces. Alrighty. I just want to look stiff on the way. There we are. Good enough. Good enough. Love my shades. Okay, now then, let's get our flowers going. Um, where's my little toy toy? Here we go. Ain't these red flowers? They're pretty, ain't they? Ooh, I love them. I love them. I'm glad she likes red. Because I like it too. I think I'm going to put one there. And then probably one of these. Right there. I don't want it to be too much. You know. I don't want it to be too much. And I'm going to be putting a, a, a coat on it. There you go baby. See, I just want it to be something, but not a lot. Mm, let's get one of these pretties. Look at that. That's pretty, isn't it? So, let's put it right here. I think I want everything in one corner, maybe. Let go, would you? Because we're going to be doing... Uh, Another color on the back of it. Red, I'm assuming. But maybe not. I'm probably going to do like a... Uh, she likes purple too. But I don't know about red and purple together. You know? I don't know about that. Alright, let's go over here. Because we're going to do this one too. Look at that. What is that? Mm -hmm. Get out of there. Get out of there. I'm going to do this one right here. 
Yet under the risen place. Okay. Push it over just a little bit. Then I'm going to take uh, one of these because you want them to match. This one ain't spread legged like that one was. Let's see if we can spread legged a little bit. There we go. Let's see if we can spread legged. I just stuck my finger in it. Okay. Yeah, that's not going to do like I want it. But anyway. I want that to go there. And then. Let's put a little one right here. Uh oh, I think that's upside down. There we go. There we go. And, 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 and. Now, maybe some greenery. Y'all think oh, I should have did a live. Dig on it. Should have done a live, babies. Because y'all have some good tips. There we go, we got that. Alright. Now then, I guess uh, I really love these. I think I'm going to go ahead and put that one in there. Like right there. Because that's the tray. That holds your uh, lashes. I never learned how to put lashes on, honey. I look like something crazy when I try to do it. It's crooked and cockeyed. Oh, my Lord. One end is stuck and the other one's not. And I just rip them off. I'm like, no, I'm not doing it. Okay. Oh, here's some more little red somethings. What is that? We just gonna fill them up, I guess. Looks like it, don't it? <laughs> My mind changed, didn't it? <laughs> Good God, it sure did. <laughs> Lord be. There we go. That one's full, so let's get over here. Put us something in there. It's hard to tell which side is which. I think this. I think, oh no. Come on, baby. Thank you. There. Now I think this one needs to be flipped. Yep. Alright, and then we have one of these left in the red. So, let's just lay that in there. And now I'm just going to throw some leaves in, and that'll be it. We'll let it cure. And, uh, I gotta take these gloves off, y'all. I'm not messing with the resin anymore, so. Because my gloves is getting in the freaking way of grabbing and opening my flowers. So, I'm gonna take them off. Come on. Come on. Alright. Because we're done with the resin, okay? I'm gonna find something to put the rest of this resin in. I knew I was mixing up too much stuff. And let me apologize if I'm not my, my, you know, crazy self. Just a little blah. But it'll pass. It will pass. I know it will. Oh, look at that. Yeah, it's got to go this way. I think that's pretty. I'm putting it in. Um, Let's put it right there. I may regret it. I hope I don't. But I might. <laughs> kind of regretting it right now. God. Oh well. It's in there. What else can we do? Nothing. Alright. And here goes some green. So. Uh, I did a tray one time I think. I think it was a tray. And baby, I filled that sucker up. You couldn't see no mold. I had so much stuff in there. And I was like, oh, I bet I put too much. But y'all know what? When I demolded it, oh my God, it was gorgeous, guys. It was gorgeous. 
Yeah. It was really pretty. I can't remember what tray it was, but I filled that joker to the round, baby doll. Let me get a little, some of this little fur off up in there. That's what it looks like, little fur. Don't it? It looks like a little fur. Alright. Now yeah, I guess I'm done. Yeah. I'm done. I'm still picking up stuff. Huh, chum? Because I love the green. I love green in it. Oh, look down in here. Here goes another little. That's different. Oh, I love that. Uh oh. Let's just put one of those in there. Why not? And then we've got to have one over there. So let's try to find one. This is a big one. Let's tear a little bit off. Tear it off. Put it right there. I'll see you, Bubble. And right there. And I need a little something something right here. So, I'll see. Let's do this one. We'll do that one right there. Alright. And when it cures, I'm going to come back and put some, uh, put some, put a color on it. Okay, loves. And you know what? I think it is, uh, well, maybe not. It looks a little even. I thought it was running to that corner, but I guess it's not. I'm just going to take my tweezers and push this down into the resin. I probably needed some more flowers. I'm going to quit. Honey, I will overdo. I'll overdo it. And she loves bling bling, so we might bling bling around the edges or something. She loves a bling bling. So I'm going to be looking and see what kind of bling bling I got. That way I'll be ready when I come back. Alright, there we are. Now I'm going to hit it with my heat gun, but i got to be quick because I don't want to burn my flowers. So I'm just tapping these leaves in. I don't think I have any more red flowers anyway. She likes purple too, but I don't think it would go now. <laughs> I do need a red flower maybe right there on top of that green and on that so it'll peek out. But I don't know. I don't know if I have any red, any more red. All right, darlings. I'll be back when it's cured. All right, babies. I'm back. Ready for the second coat. Now, I mixed up too much. But the reason I did is because I want to make my rose. This is a rose mold. And I want to make that. Now, I put my other extra in these heart molds. Thinking about putting one on top of her lid. But I'm not sure about it. So, let me take this stick out. Hope I mix up enough for the... It's not going to take much for these. Just a little spit. Is all it's going to take for that. Now, I'm going to give this a stir. This is from Eye Candy. And it's Satori White. White. And I'm talking about it's white babies. And it never, like other paste, it never, uh, it's always like this. It never gets thick like the other. Now, I'm going to put a good bit because I want it white, white. Okay. And let's just see what we get here. White, baby. Oh, look at that. I love, I love me some eye candy paste. I'm telling you, that's some good paste. It sure is. Remember to wipe your stick because that paste, see that, sticks to your stick. So just give it a good wipe and then keep, keep it going. Now I want to take another stick and see how white it is because it's not going to, with the paste stuck to this stick, I'm going to think it's white. 
because that paste is on there. But it, it's not going to be, I don't think. But it might be because this is some good paste. So, and it don't take much. So I'm going to take this stick and I'm going to see if I can see through it. No, I cannot. And I got to use my little cup from Les Resin. Look at that little cup. I love these little cups. They hold a hundred mil. Uh -huh. Now, here we go, babies. I'm wondering if I need to put some sparkle in it. Oh, crap. I think I am. I think I'm going to put just a little. Oh, I don't even know if it'd show up. But let me just put a little bit of this uh, Unicon Art Crushed Crystal in it and see, see what it does. Because I just want to, you know, don't take much of stuff and it flies everywhere. I'm going to put a half of this little spoon and see what that does first. Yeah, I don't see it. So, I'm going to put another little half. Just go a little bit at a time. A little bit. Because you don't want it silver. Which that, oh, that stuff blows everywhere. Oh, yeah, I can see it sparkling. I think I'm going to put one more little half in there. And then that'll be it. There we go. That's it. I love that stuff. I love it. Yes, I do. Alright. Okay, love machines. That's all she wrote. Now I'm just going to pour a little bit and let it spread because I don't need much. This is just for the top. And I don't want to over pour. <coughs> Excuse me. Lord mercy. Look at that. I think it's too much. You know what? I might have mixed up enough. I thought I mixed up too freaking much. I bet I did. It just don't want to spread because these beads. I'll try to get it all the way up to the edge. I may have to trim the doggone thing. Might have to. I hope not. Uh oh. There's a bead sticking up. Y'all see it? Dang gum it. I missed that bead. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Have to take something to chop it off. I don't like sand and resin. It goes everywhere. Okay. Alright, we got that now. Let's see about this. I think the white's going to make that red pop, don't y'all? Okay. Well, I guess I did need that much. Yes, I did. That's perfect. I bet I don't have enough for my rose. See that? Talk on it. That makes me upset. That bead sticking out. That's all right. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Dagum! Look, that one little stray bead. That's irritate me. Can tell. Everything else is perfect and pretty. And then that one little bee, you got to be sticking up in the air. Make sure you get it all the way to the edge. I love this eyelash mode. 
I got two more old grandbabies and in on my oldest daughter's side to start wearing eyelashes. And then I got two grandgirls of my youngest daughter. She has two girls. And I'm sure they're going to be starting to wear eyelashes before we know it. And then I have um, two of my guy grandbabies up the road. I'm sure they're going to be wearing them for long. I'm going to wipe this just a little bit with the stick. There we are. There we are. All right, darlings. I'm going to cover it up so I want nothing get in it. And I'm. I, this is not going to be enough for my rose. It's just a little bit in there. So I'm going to try to find them. Let's do this heart mold. I'm going to give it a good wipe. Give it a good wipe. And we'll just put it in here. We'll put it in here, babies. I hope my name comes up. I see it in there. There it is. But it will not show up on the on whatever I put the stuff in. I don't know why it won't. Just make us a little heart. Might put this on top of it. Since it's white. I'm hoping this is cured before I go to bed. But I bet it won't be. Bet it won't be babies. Might be in the morning. And tomorrow's Wednesday giveaway. <laughs> I'm behind, Dana. It might have to be a Thursday giveaway. How about that? <laughs> but if this gets done before I go to sleep, then we'll do the Wednesday giveaway tomorrow. But if it don't, we'll do a Thursday giveaway. How about that? Alright, sweet angel pups. Y'all know what I'm thinking. I want to spray. I want to use my glitter sprayer, doggone it. To get these gloves off. I want to just see how it puffs out. I might just do it on, on this. So, here we go. If it gets on that, it's okay. That's the back. So, let's see. Look at that. Here we go. So, what we get. Oh, I don't know if y'all can see. Oh, look at that. Look at that, guys. Oh, yeah, I'm getting carried away, ain't I? Holy moly. Ain't that gorgeous? Ain't that just gorgeous? Now I want to put some on this. You know, just make it pretty. Why not? Put some over here. Give it a little color besides that bland white. I knew I was going to do it. I knew it. I knew it when I started looking at it. I should have just left it alone, but it didn't, did I? I got this from Nutrisoap. My affiliate link will be down below, and y'all could get you a glitter pump, glitter pump, babies. Get you a glitter pump. Glitter makes me happy. Um, Let's see if these are ready. We'll take these out and raise you up. Just a little bit. They might be ready. Oh, yeah. Oh. This has just got the um, crushed crystal in it. That's all. Ain't that pretty? Oh, I love it. Oh, my God. <laughs> Glitter gets me excited. Oh, look at that one. That one's pretty. These are some fat little hearts. See the difference? Shape different. And then I got one more. Got about my little heart mode. And now here's all three. Ain't they pretty? Yeah. Crushed crystal in them. I think they're gorgeous. Alright, love machine. You know what? I was thinking. 
I could put one of these, like this one, put it off in there. Wouldn't that be cute? What do y'all think? Oh, God. I think I'm going to do it. Why not? Hey, let's just do it. It's sure not going to come up above it. Let's just do it. Look at that. It's in there now, babies. I ain't no taking it out. <laughs> there we are. We did something new, didn't we? All right, darlings. I'll be back when it's ready. All right, babies. I think it's uh, cured enough. It's still a little bendy on the top, but I think it's cured enough to take it out. Because I pulled right here and it popped off, so I'm going to try it. See how much overpour I got. How much? Oh, there's some. There's some. Well, it's not much. Okay, just rest. Rest, honey. Just sit there and rest. Okay. Let me get this. Oh, this one. Uh-uh. See? It's still sticky. Yeah. Doggone. This one's not ready. It's ready on this side. Is that not weird? <sighs> well. I'll be back. See, that's weird. It's not. Alright. I'll be back. And then I'll flip this over and let y'all see this one. Okay. All right, babies. <laughs> y'all, I cut the heater off because you know um, when you let it, when it gets hot, you know, is when it's curing, it gets hot. You see. Now, when I cut my heater off, temperature dropped just like that. It's cold here. It's cold. But guess what? It's going to be sixty something degrees tomorrow. Sixty something. Yeah. Is that not crazy? So anyway, look. Hard rock. Oh. Sneak peek. Alright, let's get this out. See? This is even ready. That makes no sense. But there it is. Not even sticky anymore. So we're going to take it out. And put that right there. Is this ready? It is. This is even ready. Now, when I left out of here, this was mushy. It was mushy. I got it all over the back of it. Y'all, this is a long video. Mm, mm, mm. It's long, babies. Let's see if I can get it off. Oh, well. I'll do that in a minute. So, here we go. Look at that. This is the top. See the eyelashes? See where the eyelashes go? One, two, three, four, five, six. Three pair. Look at that beautiful red. And look at the edges. Oh, I love it. I love it. I hope she loves it. Oh my God, I think it's so pretty. I think it's very pretty. And of course, you just seen the top. <laughs> and this goes on here. And she puts her little eyelashes in there. Let me get it on here right. There we go. Look at that. And look at the back. That's pretty, huh? But there's her little eyelash tray. Now, I thought about, y'all know I wanted to put a little hinge. But I don't think, I don't think it's going to be thick enough for that. Take on it. Needs a little trim on. Oh, that's so pretty. My Lord, that's pretty. I love it. I think it's so pretty. I'm going to give this a little trim on my hair. Because it's just a little bit too much sticking out. I don't like it. I don't like it, babies, so. I don't know. Look at that. I've got my glasses on. That's stuff flicking everywhere. And the bead, I took my little snippers and snipped it off. And then, uh, see, you can't even see it. Can't see or feel it or nothing. And um, then heated my resin back up and it flowed right over the spot. 
Okay, that's enough. Oh, wow. I got a little bubble hole. Dog on it. But anyway, I think she's going to love it, y'all. I think she's going to love it. So freaking cute. It's weird how it just goes on one way, huh? But anyway, close is good. Look at that. And there it is. I love it. So, yeah, the hinges is not going to work. They're not. So, I think this uh, back is my favorite part. I do. I think it is. And that's pretty, too. All right, my little machines. I done made one heck of a mess. I'm going to try to get this heart out. I'll do it like that. Oh, gone. How can I get it out? Mm, come on, baby. Come on. Just give me one little corner. Give it to me. Give it to me. Because it over poured a little. It's laying like right on top of the mold. Mmm. That gum you. Here we go, I think. If I can get my finger up there. Oh. I got it now, babies. I got it. Oh, I got it, babies. Look at that. Turned out so pretty, didn't it? Look at that. I think it's gorgeous. I thought about putting it in the middle of this. That's why I put drop this heart in there. Look at that. What do y'all think? I think that would be precious. And then when she wants to open it, she can just pick this up and it'll pick this up for her. How about that? Yep, I think I'm going to put that on there. That is so pretty. I may take a red um, pen and go around it. Outline. Do that. And I think it will be precious. Anyway, love, that's it, my babies. Sash wrote. Let's do the uh, blessing board and the prayer card. On a bonus, we almost done, almost an hour long. Blessing board for December is Cabbage Patch Soap, Tazalyn Silver Cat, Christine Watkins, Miss Billy Holman, Miss Stacy Snorth, Miss Angel Ortega, Miss Barb Ridings, Miss Margaret Woods, Mr. Andrew Walker, and Miss Tanya McCord. Shout outs, Miss Cat Jones, Color Bloom Art on Instagram, Cosmic Carol Creations, India Brady Art, Art by Me by Andrew Walker. Billy Holman Creations, Cabbage Patch Soap, Beaten Crazy Custom Creations, Tiger Moth Resin, Stacy underscore the Crafty Cat on Instagram. Um, on TikTok, her name is at SSMurf1018. Congratulations, Miss Stacy, for 300 subscribers. That's great, baby. Uh, continue prayers for Miss Vicky Frank. Miss Billy Holman and her family. Uh, Miss Christina Hutchinson's daughter. She's due February the 9th, I believe is what Miss Christina said. So let's send prayers, baby. It's getting close, Miss Christina. Oh, Lord Jesus, it's getting close, honey. Miss Rose and her mama. Uh, Miss Annette, her mama passed, baby. So let's continue prayer. Praying for Miss Annette. And Miss Janice's daughter-in-law, Ashley, her mama passed also. So let's send prayers her way too, darlings. Miss Patricia, bless her heart. She's sick. Bless her heart. She just can't kick it. Can't kick that flu. It's just horrible. That stuff is just horrible. Makes you feel so bad. Continue prayers for Mr. Dave. That's Stacy's friend. Um, who bought me a super thanks for December was Miss Cat Jones. And who bought me a coffee for December was Miss Brenda Hickerson, Miss Gillian Moore, Miss Alice Rule, and 8subsquina.com. Still don't know who that is. But let's get this here now. Oh my God. I think I'm putting that on there. That is so pretty. All right, let's get us a prayer card. Whoa, that temperature dropped in here, baby, and that resin cured hard rock. Sometimes you got to get it. You know, when it's cold, I mean hot, 
you hit it with a blast of cold and ain't got no choice but to get hard, does it, baby? All right, here we go. Let's see what our message is today. And I'm going to dig that uh, diamond paint now. I'm, oh, Lord. Y'all, I still hadn't done the pyramid, that big pyramid. <laughs> I still hadn't done it. I'm scared to death of that thing. All right. I hadn't done it again. I did it once and it didn't turn out. And I'm like, mm, well, that's a sign. Okay, here we go. My flesh and my heart may fail, but God is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. Amen. Yes, he is. Yes, he is, babies. May the grace of the Lord Jesus be with God's holy people. Amen. Revelation 22, verse 21. Mm -hmm. Let's read it again. May the grace of the Lord Jesus be with God's holy people. Amen. Oh, amen, baby. That's right. I love that one. Mm -hmm. All right, sweet angels. I'm clean up my mess and uh, get this video posted for my little love machines. Now, I made me a little rose out of the... I don't know why y'all can't see nothing. Don't have my other one. Um, made me a little rose, but I don't know. That's what that um, that uh, y'all know what I'm trying to say, don't you? Crushed crystal. Mm -hmm. I think it just needs like a hint, hint of gold. What y'all think? I think that's what it needs, babies. All right, so I'm gonna um, trim this in red and upload the video so y'all can see it. And if y'all enjoy it, give it a thumbs up, baby dolls. I do appreciate it so much. And, uh, mm, look at this thing just filthy. I got to clean that. All right. I will see y'all on the next video, babies. I think that's it. It's, I feel like I am forgetting something. Oh, maybe I'm not. But, mm, if I am, y'all please let me know. I, I just feel like I am, but I'm not sure about it. All right, well, I'm going to let you go, sweet angels, and y'all sleep sweet, okay, and I love y'all very much, very, very much. Peace, love, prayers, and happiness, babies. Bye!